Hey, collective. Quick energy check. See what your ancestors, the universe, the divine want you guys to know as you're navigating through your journey, ascending to your highest good. I've called in the appropriate protection. Archangel Michael is in the building. Archangel Michael is in the building. <sighs> Ancestors of the highest white light, I ask that you help me provide clear messages for the collective. Overall energy. Cleansing. Intensification. <clears throat> I'm seeing this big energy field being lifted. Some of you guys are feeling like you guys are purging out a lot, cleansing, releasing a lot. Some of you guys, some of you guys may be feeling the collective's release. And it's becoming too much intense for you guys. Rebirth. This is helping you guys have a rebirth. Initiation. Some of you guys are going through an initiation. So some of you guys are having <coughs> an intense um, initiation. This initiation may be feeling really intensified at this time. That's because you're releasing, you're cleansing for this rebirth. What is this initiation? Let's start with the initiation. What is this initiation, my beautiful ancestors of the highest white light? Only of the highest white light? Nothing other but the highest white light? What is this initiation? Show us the cards we need to see, see, and think. Grounding. Some of you guys need to get to Mother Gaia and ground yourself at this time. Show gratitude to your ancestors to help you guys through this initiation. Yeah, because you guys are being guided. Show gratitude to your ancestors. Energetic clearing. I know what I'm feeling, son. I know what I'm feeling, son. You guys are clearing. There's a lot of cleansing here. Grounding. But this is going to bring you to a rebirth. You guys are going through some kind of initiation with your ancestors. And it feels really intensified at this time. Expansive. It's, it's going to expand you. Ex expansiveness. Yeah, some of you guys, some of you guys are releasing the ego. Some of you guys may have been feeling constrained. But this is going to expand you guys. It's going to help you guys get in flow. <clears throat> what else can we pull? Universe, 
The universe is behind this. You guys are star seeds. You guys are star seeds. The universe is helping you release this. This intensification, it feels like a lot. Show gratitude at this time. I feel like this is a global, universal, energetic clearing that's happening here. That's what I was getting in the beginning. I feel like a lot of people are releasing and purging out. And this is why it feels so intensified. People are expanding. People are, the collective is um, expanding. Um, what, that's not the word. The collective is, their gifts are enhancing. Enter one step forward, one step onward. Oh, you don't need to see the full path. Just take the next steps. Some of you guys, yeah, Spirit is saying surrender to flow. A lot of us, guys, when you're on this journey, you're walking into the unknown. You're not going to know. That's so crazy because I was looking at, the, I, I was seeing a card that said, surrender the need to know, to know, to know it all. Some of you guys need to surrender that. The need to know, just trust and walk in faith. You're being guided, not only by your ancestors, the universe, your star seeds. you are planted <coughs> balance <coughs> bloom bloom where you are planted to one jump this is what spirit needs you to do is trust trust take that leap of faith you're not going to know everywhere you're going so a lot of us are walking walking without knowing where we're going where spirit is guiding us we just have to trust those intuitive feelings you're loving your old self kids are very intuitive yo and i could vouch for that kids are carefree they're if they if they 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 are so intuitive okay they don't care if they fall they're jumping they're gonna make that jump that's what spirit needs you to be in that kind of flow in your child childlike innocence kids are very carefree they're very um curious okay and if and if if they get hurt they brush it off and they keep it going one step forward one step onward that's how spirit needs you to be right now bloom wherever you are as we become adults just think about it guys when you guys were kids did we give a fuck if we got hurt we would scuff our knees on the fucking ground pavement Rub that shit off and keep playing. We didn't care who seen us fall. 
We didn't care who seen us acting like little little kids, carefree. We didn't care. As soon as we start getting older, we start worrying about those kind of things. Who's watching? Who's seeing? Oh my God, that's embarrassing. Oh my God, I'm not going to do that. Oh my gosh. We lose that child, child. And when you're on this journey, you need to tap into that. There's no way you're walking this spiritual journey without tapping into this childlike innocence. Spirit needs you to, to trust the unknown. Because somebody here is going through an initiation and Spirit needs to know that when they tell you three, two, one, jump, you're going to fucking jump. Yeah, how this could be wonderful. Man, I know when <laughs> ancestors, yeah, your ancestors are guiding you. Your ancestors, your star seeds, the universe. Look at this. Before I started my journey, people used to be like, What do you want to do? Let's go to the park and swing on the swings and just go. Phew. I want my feet to to be touching the sky. Be like, what? People used to be like, what? Go swing on the swing. Yes. I used to love doing that. I still do. I want to feel that, that, oh my God, I'm flying feeling again. I remember that feeling. And this is how spirit needs somebody in here to be. Trust. You're going to have a rebirth here. Whatever this three, two, one jump is, that this universe, your ancestors, and your star family, your galactic family is guiding you towards. It's an initiation. You need to release and cleanse the ego. The ego is exhausting you. Ground yourself. The ego will tell you, oh my God, don't do that. That's embarrassing. We need you to be in this childlike energy. Each evolutionary turn requires you to give give up who you think you are. Yeah, there's a lot of 11s here. Synchronicity is a love letter from the universe across time and space. Trust. Trust that you're being guided. Zoo. gonna know every fucking step of the way and if you're that damn controlling that means you're in your ego spirit needs you to be carefree child following these these synchronicities three two one jump when i tell you to jump turn left when i tell you to turn left yeah releasing karma a lot of you guys are feeling this energetic release Magic is manifesting. Your dreams, visions, goals are becoming reality. Stay focused. Move beyond drama. Create your own path. Make room for good energy. Yeah, there's a big cleansing happening here, son. A big cleansing. Spirit's making me grab this deck. I usually end with this. Spirit does not need you to be timid and scared. You're going through, somebody's going through an initiation. It's very important that you cleanse, you guide, you stay grounded. So when these synchronicities come up, you don't question. You're in flow. Yes, yeah, cycles and rhythms. Spirit needs you in this energy. Flow. Flow.
What did I say? There's a big release happening. Look at all that energy releasing out to the universe. Be strong. The divine loves you. The divine loves you. Unconditional love for you. Some of you guys relate to having deities from Sekhmet. Mary Magdalena. Bodies of water. There's a lot of cleansing, undenying love. Spirit has a lot of love for you, man. Your ancestors are not going to guide you on the wrong path. When you walk in timidness and scaredness, you don't trust your ancestors. You don't trust the guidance that you're getting. That's what it's saying to them. You have yet to trust them. Look at this. Guiding children. This is how spirit needs you to trust. Believe in the fairies. Believe in the magic. Believe. Somebody's not believing. Because this is going to bring a bright future for you, man. Art, yes, this is what spirit, this is why they made me grab this deck. Look, Archangel Michael is here. Listen to these intuitive feelings. Spirit needs you to get creative. Tap into your inner child, your creativity. What do you like to do the most? If it's singing, sing. If it's dancing, dance. If it's drawing, draw. Art, paint. Gardening, garden. If it's going to Mother Gaia and putting your feet on bare soil, do that. Putting your feet on bare soil will fucking help you release these energies quicker. Somebody's going through an intense initiation. That's because they're releasing a lot of karma. Go outside. Blossom. Come on, collective. We do this too long, man. Come on. Integrity. Align your actions so that they match you. Um, match your values and inner knowings of what's good for you. Some of you guys are like, oh my God, people are going to see me at 40 years old swinging on a swing. That's so embarrassing. People what are going to think, who the fuck cares? If you want to go swing on a fucking swing, go swing on that fucking swing. Period. If you want to, if you want to, yeah, eat healthy, do it. I'm getting intense. Why spirit? Why spirit? <laughs> I love you guys so much. <laughs> okay. Yeah. You're emotionally sensitive right now to energies. If you get nervous, focus on service. Remember why you started this path I'm hearing. It's not so everybody could like you. Because when you're on this journey, it's a it's a solo mission, man. I, I, I don't know no tarot reader that says that they're surrounded by a whole bunch of individuals. And if they are, you already know. This journey is a, a, a lonely journey. It's an alone journey. You're not going to have people surrounding you, rooting for you. These people are not going to be rooting for you. It, especially in the physical right here. In your presence, in your energy that's around you. You're going to find your soul tribe doing what spirit is asking you to do. It's not going to be those same type of people you used to be around. And who the hell cares what those people think? One step forward, one step forward onward trust trust this is what I got for you guys love and light